Good morning, party people. Welcome to The Breakdown with the lonely Johnny, all by himself. Uh, Nathan will be back soon, so don't worry if you're missing the banter between us. Uh, I'm doing my best here, kids. Give me a break. Anyway, today uh, I'm going to jump straight into it. going to check out the latest one from Bloom. Aussie boys, uh, the Aussie counterparts, if you will. And I say that in the best way possible because they have a really incredible take on the melodic hardcore sound. Uh, Nathan and I have both really enjoyed everything that we've heard from these guys and checked out from these guys. Uh, it's been awesome seeing them get that recognition and, and start to blow up and obviously announced on Good Things Festival, uh, just signed to Pure Noise Records as well, which is massive. So I'm keen to check this one out and have a listen. Um, you know, they're just lovely dudes as well. And we love to give the love to the Aussie bands here on the channel. It's important to us to support our countrymen. Um, so it's important that you support us, even though we're not your countrymen. So that doesn't really make much sense at all. But do it, please. I nearly choked on my own spit. <laughs> That's fucking gross. Anyway, like and subscribe. Check out the socials. Check out, um, you know... The TikTok we sometimes post on there. Check out all the interviews we've done. Just check out all the things, all right? Just, you know, be nice. Help us out. Anyway, love you guys. Let's get into it. Straight in. These chords are really cool. Love that melodic guitar as well. Sick. Harmonies will always get you, boy. Woo! Double kick close there is tasty. Sick tone in his screen. Jonah has a great screen. Cool. That chord progression is so cool. Uh, I think there might be a chorus coming, so I'm trying to find the best place to pause. I love the approach to their guitars. It's super chaotic at times, but it's you know it's always rooted in that melodic hardcore. It's always rooted in that real nice. It just sits up there in the nice bit. The ah, this is nice bit. Um, and I really like that because it's really nice. That's why it sits in the really nice bit. I'm out of things to say. I'm rambling. Gonna keep going. Stretching those vocals on this one. Big course. That is, that is fucking cool. That's so good. I love the way the vocals play off each other. It's cool. That was fucking heavy for me, boys. Love that. I love the color palette that they've gone for, the, the blues and stuff. The blue, mmm, because it's blue and it's tasty. Uh, it looks really sick and flashing between the, the normal stuff and then this is really cool. And I think we're going to get a big, fat, juicy breakdown. Fingers crossed. Not fingers crossed. Excitement. Woo! Let me 
Lucky. There's deep, heavy vocals on sick edition there. I love the space in this chorus as well. Just really letting those chords just ring out. Letting the heavies and the cleans play off each other. Sick. What are they eating? Okay. Good song, but now I want cake. Yeah, I like that. That was sick. That was really good. These dudes are, you know, like, I guess it's expected when a band continues on that they get better. But these guys are getting better and better. And I'm really excited to see what the future holds for them. Um, yeah, because I love the fact that they're also quite different to all the other Aussie bands uh, in, in the space that they're in, you know, like obviously they're, you know, contemporaries of bands like Thornhill and Void Division and North Lane and, and Polaris, but they don't sound like any of those bands, which is a great thing because there's the heaviness and there's the melodic stuff there that appeals to so many different people. Um, in a musicality sense, it, it's really interesting to me. They They just use really nice chord shapes and stuff to to really sort of widen that guitar sound. And look, I mentioned Counterparts before, and it is something that that band does really well. Uh, and then the juxtaposition of that against where they go into those chuggy, heavy moments with the little, you know, those tasty little harmonised licks that they throw in and stuff is really sick. Still want to know what they were eating before the cake. Um, I'm, not, I'm actually not a huge cake fan. Are you a huge cake fan? What's your favourite cake? What's the best cake you've ever had? If cake isn't your thing, what is your thing? I really like creme brulee. I know that's a standard fatty thing to say. But then again, it's, I don't think it's much worse than cake. Anyway, I'm rambling and I'm by myself. So it's weird. Thanks for hanging out with me, guys. Appreciate you. Go and give Bloom some love. Of course, the description for the video will be below in the information. Let us know what you thought about the song. And yeah, give them some support. And thanks for hanging out again. Appreciate you. Peace.